Hello and good morning. Today is October the 21st, Monday morning at 9.33 a.m. Central Standard Time, and this is Ernest O'Dell. And I'm going to do a real quick tutorial for you how to uh, open up an account with classified ads. It's free. You can post a free ad. Now, there's a few places I will mention. There's a few places in there where, you know, you might have to pay. But most of them, just about 99.99% of them are free classifieds, okay? I'm going to show you how to uh, open up an account, create one, and an ad all at once, okay? Uh, if you go in here to log in, you don't have an account, it's, it's going to ask you to uh, log in with Facebook. You can use that and not have to create a, a login account. Uh, and then you can post an ad and then at the end of the ad post uh, portion it'll ask you to create an account so let's do that okay so you go to classifiedads.com and you don't have to set it for any one particular city uh, you can you can type in the name of your city that uh, you'd like to post in uh, let's say uh, New York New York uh, big population cities, you can see what they have there. They, uh, they do very well, okay? You get a lot of traffic through SEO, and it doesn't take long for it to, uh, you know, kick into the search engines. Down here on the bottom, you can see the locations. I'm going to right-click, open it up in a new tab, and this will show you uh, some of the major locations, now they do have smaller cities that you can work in, that you can post in. They have Canadian cities, U.S. states, worldwide, Australia, Pacific, Canada, Caribbean, India, Mexico, uh, United Kingdom. Uh, United Kingdom, you can post just about anywhere, free, okay? So, <clears throat> let's go back here and click on post a free ad. And if you're posting for your GDI site, uh, you want to look at two categories. First category, your main category, is going to be in jobs. You could go to services and then select a subcategory, you know, for training and education, web design and tech, okay? You know, you can penetrate different categories and sectors okay but let's go back here and just look at jobs because a lot of people are looking for jobs okay and you can select business opportunities creative jobs because when you create websites you're doing creative work uh, IT jobs marketing jobs you could do something in marketing okay or people seeking jobs or office jobs or other jobs however you have to remember that you have to write your ad according to that particular category okay you don't want to you know post a business opportunity you know in a job that's looking for management or marketing okay you have to reword the ad all right make it congruent to the category all right, so let's look at um, marketing jobs real quick. Um, and if you wanted to see what people are using, go to a professional site like, uh, you know, one of these job seeking sites. Uh, uh, you name them. Uh, Career Builder is one that I can think of here. Um, let's say marketing and let's say marketing advertising sales okay and let's go to uh, New York New York and search jobs okay if you want to get an idea how to write an ad go to one of these professional sites and look at something okay client account representative okay uh, 
make your ad look like a job ad. Uh, you know, a client account representative, customer service, sales support. Uh, you could take something like this, okay, uh, and make it look, you know, like a job. You, you can uh, take something like this and uh, grab, start scraping. Hold your left mouse key down and drag down. Scroll down until you highlight a lot of this text. Okay. And let's grab these tags. All right. Right click copy. And I've got my notepad open over here. All right. And I'm just going to paste that in there. And I'm going to put my format on word wrap. Okay. So I can kind of go through this ad. I'm not going to do it right now. But here I've got a template to work with. And remember what I've talked about before is working with templates. You see people using the same template over and over on SafeList, Hercules, uh, solo ads. Use the template, but kind of work it into your own voice. All right. Change the subject line. Okay. We could say this could be our subject line up here. Client account representative, customer service, sales, and support. All right. So we could say something like that. And then change the name of, you know, the Action Power Team is looking for entrepreneurial-minded candidates. So we would change the company name to fit our company and our ad. And then... You know, when you get through writing the ad, put the link into your 30K page, or if you're using a funnel like I do uh, with PLS pages, you can put in that funnel if you want to develop a system to follow up. It's not necessary, but you can. All right, so let's go back and, you know, take a look at what we're going to put in to the ad so I'm going to take this basically, and I'm just going to do a real quick copy, select all copy. And then I'm going to go back here and let's see, client account representative, customer service, sales and support. Let's grab that first, put that in right here. Okay. Compensation, leave that open uh, DOE depending on experience okay go back over here and we're going to take that right there let me go and change the format real quick to spread out so I don't get these line breaks and we'll just uh, use a, a real quick template here, okay? We're going to paste all that in there, highlight that, change the font over to Verdana, and we're going to bring the size up a little bit so it's easier to read, about a 16-point online. It's not too big, okay? Uh, we'll say... The GDI Action Power Team is looking for entrepreneurial minded candidates who who want to have a business of their own and get out of the corporate America rap race. We are looking for 
people who are easy to teach and bring their campaigns to the next level through creative ideas, supportive teamwork, and innovative account leadership. Okay. Key responsibilities of the client account representative. You can, high, you can highlight that and then do a bold and underline. Okay. Uh, this is an independent representative 1099 job and you will work on our sales and marketing teams and serve as the primary liaison between your clients and their respective customer base. Okay, now client account representatives let's pull this and say independent representatives will learn invaluable skills essential in any business environment. These skills include um, these skills include let's say discipline Time management, work ethic, and business presentations. Okay, and come back up here, highlight that. Hold it, come over here and put some bullets on it, okay, come down here and take that bullet out, okay, to apply for this position, click here, okay, now, what I'm going to do is go back and grab a link that I have up here <clears throat> that goes not to my GDI green 30k sales page, but it goes over to the William Shatner interview, okay, in the back of uh, GDI. It's one of those replicated pages that they gave us in the back office where people can come over here and see this. They'll still sign up under you when they click on that, when you give them your link. And you go back into the GDI and get that link, uh, you know, to the William Shatner interview, okay? And then you go over here and scrape some copy and, you know, write your ad. And then we're going to come back over here and say, click here. And then we're just going to put that link in there so they can click on that link. We're going to bold it, underline it, and then we're going to give it some blue text, dark blue. Okay. And I'm going to put Ernest Odell, my email. I'm going to take my phone out. Take my love account and take my zip code out. We're going to go for nine months and we're going to put the capture code 
and I'm going to choose an image, okay? Images work well, okay? Um, what I might do is take this of the William Shatner, put that in there, and I'm going to choose another file, and I'm going to go back over to my folder where I have my picture, okay? And then I'm going to choose one more picture over here with, I think, yeah, this one is a little bit smaller. It's got my picture embedded into the, uh, to the team photo. And then I'm going to post that ad in New York City, jobs and marketing jobs, compensation depending on experience. Make it short. You can make it long if you want to, all right? You can make it look longer, like a big overblown job ad. Uh, but what it's going to do now, it's going to recognize my email address, and it's going to come back and tell me, you already have an account here. See, if you didn't have an account, then it would have you to set one up. It says, welcome back. Your ad has been saved. Log in. It appears you already have an account with us. Please log in so we can publish your ad. Don't worry. If you don't log in now, we'll send you an email with more options for your ad. And you can go back and post it later. Here, we're just going to go ahead and say, okay, let's log in. And the ad has been posted. And it's got three pictures. So when people are looking at this ad online, they can click this picture, bring it up, and see that. They can click on this, and they can see that Ernest Odell is a real human being, only he's not wearing his Harley hat. <laughs> uh, and then, of course, this is Ernest Odell's power team. There's my picture again, okay, with the Sydney Opera. Okay, and then when they come here, all they have to do is they read in the jobs, marketing jobs in New York City, uh, they can see this. It's got a short blurb. Now, like I said, you can make it longer. All right. To apply for this position, click here. It takes them over to the William Shatner interview. They can watch that video. They can sign up. As soon as they sign up, now this is kind of back in. You're not putting them through the two and a half minute video on your green sales page. This is just a, a different way to bring them in. Then what you can do is send them an email, introduce them to their uh, 30K page and the Action Power team <clears throat> and follow up with them personally. So this is uh, just another way. This is how you set up an ad, create an account with classifiedads.com. Uh, let's go back to my stuff here. Okay. And see here, it's already posted in New York City, Manhattan Marketing Jobs. Uh, client Account Representative, Customer Service, Sales and Support. All right. Uh, get down here on, I've got 24 ads. Let's go to the next 10. Shows 10 per page. Uh, here in Midland, Texas, I've gotten 16 views, which is good. Uh, I think I put that up on the 14th. Today is the 21st, so it's been a week, and it's gotten 16 views. Not bad. Here's one I put up uh, on uh, October the 14th. Uh, it's gotten 13 views. All right. Uh, let's go down here. Uh, Lubbock, Texas, where I live, has gotten 59 views. It was also put up on October the 14th. Last Monday, 59 views. People are looking for jobs here in Lowell, okay? And they're finding these jobs because it's it's SEO content that Google will bring in on certain searches, okay? So when people type in jobs and work in Lubbock, you know, it, it'll be keyworded in, you know, off of certain keywords that are in the content of that ad it will produce results, usually on the first, second, or third results page on the SERPs. 
Here you see we've got uh, video shows you how to have a five figure a month home based business for only 33 cents a day. New York City, Brooklyn business opportunities had 196 views since last Monday. Bigger population like New York, LA, San Francisco, San Diego, Houston, Dallas, uh, big cities, Indianapolis, Columbus, Ohio, Cincinnati, uh, name a big city, you know, you're, you're going to find a lot of these places will have more viewers and I've been getting leads from this. I've been getting people sign up, you know, and they contact me. I don't put my contact information up on the ad itself on many places. I don't put my phone number and email up there. Uh, they can send, all right, if, if they're on this ad, they can respond to the ad with their name, email, and a question. And then they can send it to me and classified ads will send it to my email address and then I can answer them back so I can give them a personal interaction. And that helps um, if you do. All right. We are going on 21 and a half minutes into this video, and I hope this has been helpful for you. How to create an account with classified ads and then how to post an ad on classified ads all in one. 21 minutes and 41 seconds. We're going in to 22 minutes, and I want to cut this short, and we'll see you on the next tutorial. Thank you.